his eyes are like a jungle He smiles, it's like the radio He whispers songs into my window And words that nobody knows Hi, my name is Mackenzie Hohen And this is my how-to project I'm here at First Farm Fields This is Miles And it is January 10th, a Sunday And first lesson today We're going to teach you how to tack up your horse With our basic tack um, first, you want to place your saddle pad onto the horse's back. So you want to go like this, and then place it right on the back of the horse. And then make sure the middle is aligned with the back's middle. So you want it high on the withers, which is this bone that connects the spine. And then you just want to make it make sure that is really high. Next is your um, sheep pad, or we call it another saddle pad. It's just to give you more um, support and cushion. <laughs> so then you just want to place that right on top too. And maybe you want to pull it a little more. So just place that right on top. And then next is your saddle. Um, this is just a regular English saddle. So you want to grab it. And then you want to go like this and place this up. And then you want to place it over the back. So like that. And then you could keep putting it up more if you want. Okay, and then next is our girth, which secures the saddle to the horse. You know, because I don't really want to fall off. <laughs> so first of all, you want to um, place the saddle the right way. The front should be this hook. So it should be like this. So then you want to put place your girth through this little strap that secures with the saddle pad. And then you want to hook it on to the outer attachments. You want it a look pretty tight. So, like this. And then I'll put it under and I'll do the other side. Okay, now I'm going to talk about um, my riding outfit. Um, when you're riding, you should have a proper riding outfit. So, um, these are my breeches. They're like tight pants, and then over them I have my chaps, and then my riding boots. And then I have a jacket, because sometimes it gets really cold here. I have my riding helmet that I got for Christmas, which is spectacular. <laughs> and then I have some gloves, so my hands won't like get hurt when I'm on the reins. So now I'm going to talk to you about the bridle. Okay, so now we're going to place the bridle on him. And the first thing you want to do is um, detach the little hook from the halter. This is a halter that just keeps him secure while I'm tacking him up. Then you want to take this off and then slip it back through so I won't. I can still have some control. And then I'll hook it on. <laughs> and then I'll come over here to get my bridle. Um, right here we have the basic, like the nose band that secures his, hey, hey, <laughs> that secures the bridle to his, <laughs> the bridle to his <laughs> mouth, and he just likes to itch because he's old like that. <laughs> okay, so then I'll grab his, grab his face right here, and then I'm gonna place the reins. Will go right here on the headband, headband, <laughs> and then I'll place the in his mouth and then, there and then I'll slip it over his ears and then I'll secure the nose band and this the nose band will go under the main strip and sometimes he doesn't like it so he'll chew and then the nose band should be um, very secure so you should it should be fairly tight and then your other band should be um, like a, maybe a, a tad loose. So, so after I secure this, I'm gonna grab my, I'm gonna take his reins so I can hold his reins. And then I'll take his other secure and bring it over here, over his neck. And then I'll secure it. So it should be like, um, if you see it should be about a fist, you could put your whole hand through it. And then 
after that, we'll take off his halter and we'll head to the mounting block. Sorry. Okay, so now I'm gonna stop him. And in order to mount, you have to have your stirrups down, which is the, where you place your uh, feet. So I'm gonna take it down. And I'm gonna go on each side and go like that. And then what you wanna do, you wanna, eight. You wanna so now you wanna place your reins over his head. And you wanna step up since Mackenzie's a little short. <laughs> And then you want to make sure it's all secure, and then you place it, and then you jump on. And then you want to head into the ring to get started. The first thing you want to do is get your horse in a working walk, as shown in the video. So right now, I'm doing the collective sitting trot, and in the sitting trot, you want to stay as still as possible in your saddle. And by doing that, you get your sitting trot. A horse's trot is a two beat gain. That means two feet are on the ground while two feet are coming off the ground. When the horses trot, their legs move in diagonal pairs. So the right front and left hind and vice versa. When you post, you want to rise up on the outside diagonal, meaning when you are out of your saddle, the outermost leg or closest to the fence is forward. Now shorten up your rein a little bit again. There, right there. So that, that way your elbow stays out front and you can keep that connection. Good. The canter is not a two beat gain, but four. To get the horse to canter, you want to start with your outermost foot or foot closest to the fence to slide back with pressure. Then if your horse is trained, it will follow directions and give you the canter. During the canter, you are rotating your body with the horse's movement. Forward back, forward back, forward back. Like in a posting trot, but not coming out of your saddle. In the canner, I will practice my two point, which is your jumping position. When you are in the two point, you are out of your saddle in the front. And your two point, go down, arch your back, stomach forward. One, two, one, perfect. And sitting. Okay, now that we're done with our lesson, um, we're gonna get off him, so we wanna drop start, drop our stirrups, and then we wanna swing over to the side and push off like that. And then we're gonna put up our stirrups. On both sides. And then next, I'm gonna teach you how to untack him. Okay, so, oh my gosh, this is Janine and Michelle, I think you guys already know that. Um, so, I hope so. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> so, um, they're going to help me. They watched my lesson and I hope I did okay. Okay, so now we're going to, I'm going to ask you guys some more things. <laughs> then I'm going to place the halter back on his neck <laughs> to secure it. Okay, so one of you hold the reins and then one of you hold me. I'm the hold first. Okay, wait, wait, no. So, so now, here, do you want to switch sides? Okay, and then, here, do you just want to go like this? Like down like that. And then, we'll do, go ahead. And then, um, so, we'll just brush it and then she'll come to the front. She'll come to the, we'll come to the front and we'll brush his bangs. That's all I like. <laughs> and then and then that's it for the day <laughs> thank you for watching